What's going on everyone? Moose here, Air Guns of Michigan. And today I'm gonna kind of finalize my thoughts on the pro slugs uh, that were sent to me to test out. And um, <laughs> never seems to fail. I don't get messages all day long. As soon as I start shooting a video, everybody and their brother seems to want to reach out to me. It's kind of annoying sometimes. <laughs> But uh, we're going to talk a little bit about the 357 and the 457 rounds. Um, you know, you guys saw the groups that we did, um, you know, with um, the Air Force Texan 357 as well as the Air Force Texan 457 LSS. And, um, you know, I want to talk a little bit about the, the slugs from each one of these batches that actually perform the best for me personally, um, the um, the slugs in the 357s that did the best were the Venoms. Um, these were the 160 grain, um, you know, and once again, you know, I, I, I said it in the videos and I want to say it again. <clears throat> Guns are tuned specific to slugs, in my opinion. Um, sometimes they just shoot better at different velocities. So the way that I have my Texan set up, it really enjoyed these 357 um, Venom HPs. They are hollow points. You guys can see right there. And uh, there's the slug right there. And um, you know the other ones just didn't fly that well for me. Now. I do want to say that my Texan, um, let me see if I can scoot this over just a little bit. There we go. My Texan seems a little slug picky. Um, I've had Nielsen's through it, Lucky 7 Air Ammo, um, the Pro Slugs, um, a few other uh, brands that are kind of like off brands. And um, honestly, it, it's very, very picky on the slugs that it likes. But it did throw those, um, the, uh, the Venoms, um, probably the best. And this would be the one that if I was going to use these for like hunting in my 357, that um, I would tune the gun around. Um, and then when we get to the 457, the, um, the Reapers, these things, if you guys saw that group that I shot in the 457, which I know you did, um, we sent three of these 420 grain hollow points uh, down range, and every one of them uh, basically looked like three little like dots. I mean, that's how accurate uh, these things were coming out of my Texan LSS. Um, unfortunately, during that testing, uh, I couldn't do the uh, 530 grain Goliaths. Um, turns out that if I had a stock Texan in 457, it would be able to manage those. But uh, with the LSS, I guess there's uh, a smaller breach opening. So it is what it is. But these were the two that flew the best for me. They were both hollow points. Um, both of them are very similar in construction and um, they just did an outstanding job uh, if you guys could see in the video. So, you know, pro slugs, man, these guys are the real deal. They're, uh, they're certainly uh, very capable slugs. So if you guys are in the market for some slugs, um, you know, pro slugs is certainly an option and uh, they do quite well. So with that being said, I'm Moose. This is Air Guns of Michigan. Those are all pro slugs. And uh, those are the two that my Texan enjoyed the best. So maybe, uh, maybe your Texan will enjoy them as well. So until next time, be good to each other and God bless.